In Tears of the Kingdom, there are small, glowing, rabbit-like creatures called bloopies. Dealing damage to these will cause them to drop rupees, but make sure not to defeat them as they would run away towards the entrance of a nearby cave. Another way to find caves is to offer fruit at a cherry blossom tree. This will cause the Lord of the Mountain to come by and mark all the caves in the area. Every single cave has a bubble frog, a frog with a similar design to the Lord of the Mountain. When defeated, these bubble frogs will drop a bubble gem and a check mark will appear by that cave's icon on the map. These bubble gems can be traded in for special gear by an NPC near the woodland stable. You can throw an ice item into water to make an ice platform. This can be fused to a weapon to make more ice platforms, or fused to a shield to be able to shield surf really fast. Thank you to Fuakiji for this comment. The shock emitter might seem to be an item that doesn't have many uses. This is until you remember that fish and electricity aren't exactly friends. Anyway. Are you having fun exploring Tears of the Kingdom?